Hello friends, welcome again and this is my new project Smart City Device Management System and this project I have developed in Java, JSP and MySQL the version for the JDK I am using is the JDK 1.8 and the MySQL version is 5.6 also for connecting the MySQL and the Java JSP I have used the MySQL connector Tomcat version I am using is the Tomcat version 7 but if you have Tomcat version 8 and 9 you can easily configure this project on Tomcat version 8 and 9 also so these all server technologies database i have used for developing this project smart city device management system so for uh, front-end development this is a web-based application so for front-end development i have used html css and javascript some of the jquery library also have used like for form validations for date calendar plugin integrations i have used the jquery plugin set right? so these all technology stacks i have used for developing this project smart city device management system right so let's start with the functionality go through that what we have developed inside this project so this is the home page of the project you can see this is a simple home page right there is nothing dynamic on this page this is about project and uh, this also a static page this is a login from where admin will be able to log in and perform certain operations this is a contact us page and this is a static contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page right so let's start with the login so the user id is the admin and the password is test once you log inside the system then you will get this dashboard so here the normally the main concept for developing this project is to manage the smart devices from a system right so let me go through one by one so this is the home right already explained to this is all devices all devices which you have added will be displayed here so you can see these are the devices if you click on the device then you will be able to see the device details here right so this is the device details right all devices <laughs> this is a dashboard <coughs> sorry so here you can see add devices a device from here this device name unique id each of the device has their will have their uh, unique id firmware version what firmware version it's containing device status it's offline or online the device type so it's a sensor or the smart light or the gps device so you can select from here device company means what company you have bought this device right and sensor types so it's an industrial device or home automation device so this is a device image from where you will be able to uh, choose your device image and the device functionalities what the functionality device can perform and the descriptions after filling this uh, form you will be able to save your device right once you save the device you will be able to see all of the device details here you can see this is the device details right if you want to edit it just click on the edit you will be able to edit the device details here right if you want to see the details just click oh, sorry if you want to see the details just click on the all devices and click on the device you will be able to see all of the device details here that you can see this is the device details right okay so again let me sh show you this one so from here there are four options copy csv excel pdf print right so these all options are working and if you click on the button then this all device details which is available here will be exported into the pdf format excel format or csv format or you can print this also right you can search the device details here from here also right so this is a dynamic table you can see this is the search working on the real time okay. so this is the change password from where you will be able to update your account password Right. and after updating your account password you will be able to log in with your updated password and the logout so this is a session driven menu if i log out from the system then none of the administration menu will be displayed let me show you so if i click on logout, out then nothing is showing here means there is no administration menu is showing but if i log in then administration menu is displaying here right so this all functionalities i have developed inside this project is smart dev device city device management system and as i told you earlier this project is a java jsp based mini dvms project mini because it has only and only admin login but if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest projects and videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much